Hey guys, welcome back to my channel where we have the best updates and entertaining videos. If you're new here, consider subscribing. And if you don't know, well, now you know. I'm Kimberly Nicole. In today's topic, we're going to discuss the $450 stimulus check that's going to be an additional to your salary if you're currently unemployed as a bonus to go back to work. But before we touch on that topic, I want to touch on the Unemployment Cares Act because if you are not currently on unemployment with your state, you won't be able to qualify for it. If you're looking for additional details on the CARES Act and unemployment for this pandemic, please click on this video above. But in a nutshell, the CARES Act and unemployment is the additional monies that the government has allowed each state to give to each individual that's unemployed. Unfortunately, in each state, the unemployment was too low to allow individuals to continue their current living in the pandemic. So the CARES Act had added an additional $600 to assist those individuals to continue eating and paying for uh, necessities. Moving forward, the government is trying to change up unemployment and the individuals that are currently receiving that act. U.S. Senator Rob Portman has proposed a back to work bonus, which is the $450 stimulus check per week that each individual will obtain if they go back to work. What this would mean for individuals that are unemployed, it it incentivized those individuals to get up, get a job, and go back to work. So if an individual is getting their salary, they will also get the $450 per week whilst they're going back to work until next year. Again, the only way that you can receive this benefit is if you're currently unemployed and you're on the unemployment benefits and the CARES Act. If you agree with the Unemployment and the CARES Act and the additional funds that others have received, if it hasn't been your friend or it's been a family member, comment down below your thoughts on that CARES Act and the stimulus check that I'm gonna talk about moving forward. Now, in this topic about the new stimulus check or the back to work bonus, as they're calling it, the individual is going to be incentivized for working. Now let's look at a pro. If you look at the US average for minimum wage, it's about $10.25. So an individual that's going to earn $10.25 over about 40 hours will be able to make $410. You take the $410 and you add the $450, which will essentially give the individual $860 with a potential of $3,440 a month. This will be more than the individual will be receiving on the unemployment current CARES Act that they're getting um, whilst they're at home on unemployment. So it's incentivizing the individual to get up off of unemployment and back into the workforce, stimulating the economy. Now, the con about this stimulate, this the $450 stimulus, is the individuals that are not getting that average. Let's say an individual is getting the lowest, which some states are $7.25 that individual would only get $740 a week, in essence giving them about $2,960 a month, which is technically not enough. So those individuals that are currently receiving more now being on unemployment and will receive less by going back to work, it makes no sense for them to want to be incentivized with this bonus to go back to work. Now, another con, which is a very big one for me, is how the economy has changed because of this pandemic. Most jobs that have changed or closed or, or are going to be obsolete pretty much in the next coming months and years, those individuals will not be able to go back to those jobs. So what do those individuals do? Do they go back and try to find a new type of job? Or are they going to have to get recertified in a new area, which is going to take time, effort, and training? Unfortunately, this is going to take more time and individuals on unemployment if they can't find a job that makes sense for the current knowledge that they have if it has been obsolete. 
most most companies and jobs have changed over the past two to three months because of this pandemic. They moved online. It doesn't work in that manner anymore. And so most individuals will be left without a job anyway. My last comment to you guys, I want you to comment down below your thoughts on the $450 stimulus package. Do you agree with it? Do you not? Do you have you noticed more pros and cons about this stimulus uh, to stimulate the economy? Do you feel that all individuals should get back to work regardless of how much they're being paid so that the economy can be up and running again. And my personal thought, I feel like we've all just been at home for too long and we do need to get back out there. Uh, what bill or what thoughts do you have that you want to give to the government to give them an opportunity to hear your voice as to what you think should be the next step in the stimulus check or package. If you felt like this video gave you beneficial information, please go ahead and click like. Make sure you give all the comments uh, down below. If you have any requests on the next video, go ahead and jot that down in the comments area as well. And again, I'm Kimberly Nicole and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.